Hi everyone, it's Doll Princess, and uh, today is a, another video about one of my dresses. Um, this one is not a review, um, it's just to kind of show you guys what it looks like, um, because it is one of my most favorite dresses that I own, and it is from Angelic Pretty. And for those of you who don't know what Angelic Pretty is, it's like one of the high line of Japanese fashion dresses. And sometimes, like, some of their clothes can get kind of spendy. Um, sometimes you can get them for a good deal. It all just depends. I so happen to get this dress on eBay. And when I wear it, a lot of people think it's like an Alice in Wonderland dress. And it's not. <laughs> but um, it, to me, it kind of looks like Cinderella themed. And then a lot of people who, who uh, don't say it looks like Alice in Wonderland, the other half say it looks like a Cinderella theme which I think that's what it looks like too. Um, but it is my favorite dress out of all the dresses that I own. And I, I would, if I were rating it, I would already give it like four thumbs up. But wait, I don't have like four thumbs. Okay, so two thumbs up and two big toes up. Just five stars, 10 stars, a thousand stars. I just, I love this dress so much. And I bought it years ago, so it's actually kind of old. Um, but still my favorite. So, um, this dress is Angelic Pretty, and the name of it is called Castle Mirage. So, let me get my princess necklace out of the way so you can see. But up at the top, it has this beautiful little blue lacy lace, and it kind of comes up to this from the sides too. And then it has all of these bows coming down the front of the bodice. And with Lolita dresses, they are like famous for having a lot of bows, which is cool because I love it. It's like a really pretty girly thing. And I love bows and I love frills and I love lace. So, but yeah, this one has one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> five right down the front. There is one in the back and it, it ties. Move my hair. Um. I usually have it tied a little loosely. Um, if I tie it too tight, then I feel like I'm restricted in my movement up here. So I'll tie it a little loosely, but it still looks cute. So, um, and anyway, getting back to the dress, it does have these, besides the bows, these frills that go all the way down as well with this like shimmery type gold shine that goes down too. The sleeves have little prints on it, and it's also throughout the, the dress, too. But, and then there's another bow. Maybe I should count how many bows this dress has. That'd be kind of cool to see. But there's another bow, and it has two layers of cute light blue lace on each sleeve. There's another bow in the very back with the print of the dress on it. And it also collects in the very back with a cute little shimmery, kaleidoscopy looking button. So, and then at the bottom of the bodice where it has that long bow that kind of hangs down, we have the skirt. So this has a couple layers, or actually just two. I shouldn't say a couple, just two. But the first one has this cute little lace trim at the bottom. And then it has the actual skirt. So I'm gonna try to get a good view on the print because it's just so beautiful. I love it. It kind of looks like Cinderella's castle scene with the carriage at like twilight almost. Because I think it looks like twilight or like midnight because it has like the moon, the crescent moon. But I also love the purples that it has in here and there's a lot of hidden pictures. So right here, there's like this carousel part of the castle. I like that it reminds me of Cinderella because it has the, the um, stroke of midnight clock there. And it also, where is it? Right down here, it has the carriage with the horses. They are super cute. And then at the bottom of the dress, it has these cute little like little diamonds. And throughout the whole entire dress, it's the same scene. This is the back of the dress, the side. It goes throughout the entire dress and it's even on, I think there's one of the little horses on the 
back of the bow where it collects. So again, like I was saying, I had this dress for like many years and only recently that I discovered this dress actually has pockets and they're kind of hidden in the fabric. So let me see if I can try to find it again. Oh, okay. So right here, if you're kind of looking at it first glance, it doesn't look like it, but there it is, a little pocket. And you have one on each side. So I think that's really cool. Um, usually in women's fashion, they do not give us pockets. Like, I don't know why. And if they do, they're like this big. Like you can't even put a lip gloss or a lipstick in there. You can't put anything in there. I don't even know why they have them. They're like just for looks. Like if you ever bo borrow, I was gonna say, if you ever borrow, okay, it just accidentally got an accent. If you ever borrow your boyfriend's hoodie or a sweatshirt or something and they have hoodies, or wait, they have hoodies, they have pockets. Sorry, it's still in the morning time for me. <laughs> and they have pockets. You're like, oh my gosh, there's so much room in here. It's awesome because they don't give us pockets. So I think it's cool that this dress actually has pockets. Um, they're not like as large as like a man's awesome pocket, but they are bigger than regular women's pockets, which is super cool. So, but yeah, I only recently discovered that this dress has pockets. I don't know why it took me so long, probably because you can't see it, but it's, it's in there. There it is. Yeah, it's in there, but it's hidden. Oh, here's another detail I forgot to show. At the top of the castle towers, they have these cute little ribbons or, yeah, little flags. Looks like ribbon. And it says Angelic Pretty, which is the brand of the dress, which I thought was a super cool, like, extra added detail that they did. So, and then I'll show you guys what this dress looks like in full. Get it on here. Ah, I'm trying. Maybe. Okay. And then I'm wearing it today with my tights and then my um, anime Lolita looking shoes, if I can show them. I don't know. It's, it's hard to, oh, I'm almost dropping the camera. There they are. And they got this cute little like lace at the bottom. These are from eBay. I got a little hole in my tights there. At the bottom of the foot, excuse me. But um, I really do like them. I originally bought them for my trip to California. And, yep, that is the dress. Um, it's not very, like, poofy looking. Um, if you were to buy, like, a petticoat or something to wear under it, it would probably stick out more like a Cinderella, like, ball gown looking thing. Um, but, yeah, I, I, I own a petticoat, but I just don't wear it with this dress for some reason. Uh, maybe one day I will. Um... But yeah, that's kind of kind of everything. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm hoping to make more consistently, like more videos consistently, but we'll see. So um, if not, I do know that um, in February, I'm going to be going to Hawaii and I'm hoping to tape a lot of that trip too for you guys. Um, and I can't wait, super, super excited. Anyway, so um, I'm gonna end the video here because I gotta get to work. Um, but anyway, I will see you guys later in another video. I hope you guys have a wonderful Friday. Yes, TGIF, it's Friday. Okay, you guys have a great day. See you later, bye.